Welcome to Staxpeditions, where we're asking the nerdiest question. What is your favorite Library of Congress call number range? We're taking your suggestions and going on a personalized Staxpedition just for you. So Alonzo and Margaret are here to join me today. Alonzo, who's our lucky, lucky person? Anthony Strand is sending us to PN 1600 to 1999. 1600 to 1999, that's a pretty wide range. Big range. We'll see what's there. Let's go. So here we have um, Sepatan, John Steinbeck. It's a narrative, a dramatic form of the life of Emiliano Zapata. And there's a meme uh, that I saw on Facebook, uh, and he's wearing these jeans, and they're normal. I mean, I'm sure for at the time, but the person who made this meme made sure to point out that they were skinny jeans, and so it's like pretty much uh, revolutionary at the time. <laughs> In the trenches, yeah, emphasized by the leaving um, blank space at the top. Depth. So this is a screenplay for Jules Verne's Around the World in 80 Days. Eight burrows, a half dozen ducks, four goats, and two carts for burrows. Good thing they're paying the animal handler. So heavy. Take a look at that title. Yeah, once you see that, you can't pass it by. I recognize this one because it came in in 2014, and I actually made an animated GIF of it at the time, of just the box opening. What this book is, is that um, George Lucas actually went through and looked at every frame of the original trilogy and picked his favorite still frames from there throughout the entire movie. Our memories of cinema are made in frames. They weave in and out of a story to form an emotional quilt of image and sound. Yes. Yes. What's significant about it? Well, it's like, this is the moment when he decides who he's gonna be. Well, let's see where it ends. Not that it ever truly ends. No. All right, Anthony Strand. That is what we have in PN 1600 to 1999. Enjoy.